2K did exactly what I knew they were going to do and take a look at this. 100 overall, Luka Doncic, he's the new 100 overall player. We also got some new Dark Matters, we got new rewards, and if you leave a like right on this video, we're all going to get lucky. Don't risk it because we need that extra good luck, especially with all the new players. And obviously, let me know down in the comments, which new player do you want the most? Because we're going into week two, and take a look at the new set. Oh my goodness, Vortex right here with Luka Magic. We got my boy Anthony Davis, he's getting that Dark Matter treatment, Scotty Pippen. Oh, that's going to be a nasty shooting guard because he can play the two and the three. Vince Carter, half man, half amazing. And we also have the Dark Matter Mark right here, a seven foot center with the new sets. And Tugate does mention right here, season six debut week included multiple Galaxy Silver Player locker codes, which I do like the fact that they have been giving us locker codes. And then, of course, you know, new Dark Matter reward cards to earn within my team. We always love seeing that because if it's free, it's for me. We get to earn more Dark Matters, of course. And then, obviously, Tugate does have the pay to win even though we can't even call it pay to win because you got to gamble to have a chance a chance and opportunity oh my goodness this is looking a little trippy i gotta stop looking at that oh my goodness are these special answers though please don't please no 2k okay? uh special uh special answers yeah definitely like the video for that good luck because we're gonna need it yeah special I, I knew the 100 overalls would stay special inserts but I was hoping the Dark Matters would eventually just be in the player market. But no, they are still special inserts up in here. Let's look at the, the players that are viable first. So we got Galaxy Opal, Jamal Crawford. Okay, that might be good. Jameson has a Galaxy Opal. Not bad. Terrence Ross. Okay. Ping Diamond Jaden up in here. Ping Diamond Walker. And Ping Diamond Poku. Okay, this is definitely a better set than the one we had last week, even though obviously we still want to see these Dark Matters available in the player markets. And then, of course, the special inserts. Oh, I just, I hate that word. So 100 overall Luka, as expected, you know, we, we knew he was, we, we knew it was going to be a 100 overall point guard with all the PGs we've been getting. You know, Anthony Davis, you know, Dark Matter AD, by the way, loving some Anthony Davis action. Vince Carter, Scottie Pippen, Mark. Ricky Davis, and Okafor. I'm going to tell you right now, when it comes to Luka, though, Luka Magic up in here, you know, he did have that free card. He has the Galaxy Opal. Obviously, you should at least have one of these pink diamonds in your collection, mainly this one, because this one was free. So we're getting a 6-7 point guard. Eh? But the 100 overall players, they're so rare. So, like, do they even really count? You know what I mean? Like, are they really in the game? No, they're not. They're, they're not really. I hardly see anybody get them. So Luka Magic, I mean... It doesn't really matter how good or bad he is because no one's going to get him. Now, Anthony Davis, I'm going to tell you right now, man, based on the pink diamond and the diamond that we had. And then, of course, just in general, he's going to be amazing, bro. Dark Matter Anthony Davis, big fat W, my opinion. You know, he's going to have great animations. He's going to be probably one of the best power forward setters we have in the game. Same with, like, Scotty Pippen. It just sucks that these are also special inserts, though. Scotty did have this pink diamond version, of course, with dynamic duo Michael Jordan. And so he's going to be getting that Dark Matter treatment as well. And I do like Scotty because he's 6'8". A 6'8 lockdown shooting guard is definitely going to be a W. Even though, again, they're going to be rare. You got to get lucky. We do have Okafor as well. Okafor, does he have... He does have an Amethyst. He definitely does need a big, uh, you know, boost in animations. And basically, as an Amethyst, he should be getting probably very quick. Probably ends up getting a new dribble style and stuff like that. Even though he is 6'10. When it comes to him, he's definitely just going to be... You know, probably a Dark Matter that will probably be more common than the others. Because the other one, of course... Actually, Vince Carter might be pretty common, too. In terms of, like... I don't say... I don't mean, like, common as in, like, every other pack. But as in, more common than Anthony Davis and Scottie Pippen. Because, you know, Vince Carter right here, 6'6". Six, six. We have a lot of shooting guards nowadays. We did have the uh, Showtime one. We got this one. And so, he'll be a high flyer. I'm assuming his animations will also end up getting upgrades. You know, probably new dribble style. Release timing definitely going to be probably on very quick or at least quick. Even though... Most likely very quick. So Vince Carter is also getting a card. We do, of course, have the big boy, Mark Eaton. Eaton? Hopefully I'm saying his last name correctly. Do we even have a... Uh, wait, do we not have a Mark? What? We don't have a Mark this year? No way. Do we really? Is this the first time getting Mark? Yo, really? Because last year, you know, we did have him. You know, obviously. I thought we could have sworn... I could have sworn we had one. So we did have this Invincible last year. So that's a 7'4 demigod, basically. Oh... He gonna be nasty. He came out in June last year, so he's coming nice and early as a dark matter. So we're gonna start getting, of course, more of the cheese, you know, with these cards now that Ricky Davis is getting an upgraded, you know, card. And, you know, last year we did have the infamous Galaxy Opal, Invincible, and then Pink Diamond. And the year before that, we also had him as a GOAT. He was amazing. Definitely one of the, uh, you know, my team legends that Tsuke just randomly decided to make, you know, a beast. Do we even have... 
This year, I think we had a Ruby, no? Ricky, yeah, we did have a Ruby. There we go. So 6-7, he's going to be nice as well. But again, those Dark Matters, they'll definitely be rare. He'll definitely get a boost in animations. We do have, of course, Poku. You know, I think Poku is going to be great as a Pink Diamond. I think he's going to be one of those cards that every single person is just going to buy. Because he's 7 foot. Ooh, if they make him a small forward, oh, that's going to be nasty. They might make... No, they, ah, if they make... Actually, center power forward. What about the other gold card? Center only. If he can play small forward, he's going to be the best card you can buy in the player markets. At least they are better than, like, the Isaiah Thomas, right? I mean, Jameson, 6'9". And I just realized that Walker right here is also a pink diamond. So that's a 7-foot center. You guys can see right here. So if they give him, you know, ah, normal release timing as a pink diamond, I don't think they're going to upgrade that. But hopefully they do. So that's going to be a 7-foot center, which I do like that. But it is definitely a better selection than the other ones that we had. You know, 6'4 shooting guard. Maybe they'll make him a point guard. Of course, Terrence Ross, the boss, a my team legend, 2K legend, actually. You know, he's always a boss up in here. He'll be nice, six seven shooting guard. Oh, that he's actually going to be really good, actually. Okay, so the Opals are actually looking great. Wow. And then the Pink Diamonds, too. And then Jamal Crawford. I forgot to show him because we do always usually get him. You know, in my team, Jamal Crawford, he had a Sapphire, so now... He'll most likely be a point guard as well, 6'5". But 2K, if you're watching this video, add the Dark Matters as well. Just make the 100 overall players special inserts, you know? And I feel like everybody would be happier. And let's keep it going because let's see what else. So they do mention uh, Bold right here. So obviously go after the free Dark Matter Steph Curry. I did do a crazy gameplay on him. Really good card, bro. And then you end up getting the Opals. You get the Pink Diamonds. And let's see what else. So they do mention the Locker Codes. Yes, we do like Locker Codes. They did also say, you know... Galaxy of Locker Codes. I'm hoping they keep it up, though, because the first week of this season, it, it, you know, it, it, it was good. Okay? It is good. So, hopefully they keep it up. Obviously, this Locker Code is still available. You know, hopefully we get more stuff like this because this was a W, bro. The NBA actually mattered because they gave us this Locker Code because of his retirement. So, hopefully we see that. Moment Cards 2K, bring back Moment Cards. That'd be great. We do have ourselves a new free Dark Matter, and yep, as expected. I knew they were going to give us another point guard, too. I don't know what 2K, like, they are just fascinated with giving us point guards. Like, where's the centers? Like, let me, I, I know, I know, I know. They gave us a Marc Gasol. Great. I know they're giving us a Mark, but Mark is gambling only. But, you know, like, let's get some more, you know, another point guard right here. Let, let's get, like, some more variety, you know what I mean? But I knew. I knew they were going to give us a point guard. I was off on the player. I was not expecting Gilbert Arenas, even though, he definitely should have been on my radar just because he usually tends to get a reward card anyway so single player triple threat receives the latest dark matter reward so this is a free dark matter that's what is considered a free dark matter nowadays in 2k because you either spend thousands of dollars for a chance at luca which you probably don't even get him or you get you know gilbert arenas for free by playing triple threat offline which of course you know he's not gonna be as good as luca by any means but you know does he actually gilbert arenas this year i'm pretty sure his release wasn't that great this year huh yeah, he had the diamond and then he had the amethyst. He'll definitely get that uh, upgrade because he is going to be a dark matter 99 overall player card. But I don't think he's going to be as good as like Luca by any means. Even though, isn't it kind of crazy how we just got Curry as a shooter and now Gilbert Arenas as a shooter? Who's next? John Morant? P probably, probably John Morant. And obviously the way that you get Gilbert Arenas is by getting 100 triple threat offline wins. And so I know a lot of people love playing that offline triple threat. So that definitely is going to be great. We also get a diamond. Is that wing at 50? Ooh, wait, hold on. Getting a free wing at 50 wins? That's a W because I sold them a while back. So we're getting that's okay. So so there's the center. <laughs> there we go. There, there's the center. Okay, so 7 foot 1 wing is going to be great, bro. At 50 wins? Yo, I actually like that. So they're giving us another player while we're going after the free Dark Matter arenas. Ah, and then of course, you know, your typical other rewards available for six weeks. That's going to be that one. Now they do, of course, mention, ooh, a limited ring reminder. Ooh, the NBA Finals Exchange event card. What are we going to get for this? I am very curious to know. Hold on, wait a minute. So three rings, Hall of Fame badges, four rings, 20 diamond boosts. Five rings, 24,000 MT. Six rings, eight diamond Jordan shoes. Seven rings, 70,000 MT. 11 rings, five Hall of Fame badges. 13 rings, Galaxy will build Russell. 17 rings, Lakers Celtics option pack. I did make a video on this one, if you guys remember. And so the next one is going to be the NBA Finals Exchange event card. Also available exclusively this weekend. Earn the championship ring by beating the My Team community in four out of seven games. To get a deluxe nebula pack. Oh, so we get I like that right there, cuz you 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 know who's in there, right? You know who's in there, Victor, Brandon Roy, the Nebula says. So we do end up getting a pack. 
and Team Act. Dude, I, oh, man, I wish these 100 overalls were actually, you know, possible. I want Team Act. You know, I did make that recent video asking you guys what player you wanted, and a lot of people, you know, want Team Act. Dark Matters, mainly Victor. Everybody wants Victor. So you have a chance. A free Nebula Deluxe Pack for getting your ring. So I'm definitely going to be getting that because I'm definitely going after this uh, Playoffs NBA Finals Exchange Event card, which Duke doesn't really mention what it's going to be. You know, it's just going to be great rewards because Unlimited is crazy. Okay, so that's coming as well. Quick reminder from 2K. Okay, what else do we got, though? And then Season 6, Week 2 updates. Okay, let's see, let's see. Look forward to even more reward cards. Yes, we want to see that in the next week. Check back for the My Team Playbook. We're going to be getting another set of bulk players. Nice, nice, nice. So they are keeping up with that. Basically, just rush players. But now they're called the boulder. So we're going to be getting another free Dark Matter. And then, of course, Friday, another Dark Matter. But this time in Clutch Home Online. So you guys got to let me know. What do you think about the update we're getting this week? I will say I like the reward cards. But I just wish every player was still available. And we'll see what happens. In the meantime, check out the gameplay I did with the free Dark Matter Steph Curry. Check out the locker codes. And as always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.